know, one of my good friends was doing that too. She was just kind of, you know, yeah. and so they pulled her off. <laughs> I'm, I'm recently here from California, and I'll tell you, I don't know anything in Southern California that comes close to rivaling this. St. Joseph's Hospital hosts an innovative program, the first in the Chippewa Valley, specializing in the treatment of chronic wounds and non-healing wounds, a growing problem spurred by aging of Americans and the rising rates of diabetes and other chronic diseases. Our sister's deeply rooted charism is the foundation of our hospital culture. As we celebrate, celebrate 125 years of providing Christ's healing ministry to the Chippewa Valley, one thing remains an inherent truism. The quality care and compassionate service provided by our caregivers to all they serve. Um, my name is Bobby Giles. I am the director of philanthropy here. I direct all the philanthropic efforts that this hospital um, partakes in. And I just have a short story, um, and I'll make it even shorter. It was towards February of last year when I got a call from our chief nursing officer, Jan Gee, thank you very much, Jan, who said, say, do you have like half a million dollars laying around? <laughs> do you think you could raise that? And I said, oh, sure, you need it yesterday? Um, so we kind of put our heads together. I met with our friends board, and within about three months, we had raised the half a million that they needed to complete this project. We went to a select few friends, close friends of the hospital who believe in our mission, and once again, the community responded to this need. And without them, this wouldn't be here. So as you round the corner, there's a beautiful donor wall that will recognize all the donors who made this possible. This really is your hospital, and it shows in every step of the way. I have finished it just like so they finally let her go again. Is that happening in 28K? Pretty early on. And um, you know, St. Joseph's Hospital is obviously a, a pillar of this community, and, and, and this wound care clinic is another example of that. And, you know, through, through the leadership of, of Joan and the, and the sisters and, the, and the, um, you know, we now have a state-of-the-art facility to help people get better that otherwise couldn't, which I think is, is pretty cool. Um, so on behalf of all who contributed to this effort, colleagues and community, thank you for giving us one more reason to be proud of Chippewa Falls and, of course, St. Joseph's Hospital. It was fun. Yeah. It was a, a enjoyable day. That way. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, I hope you check that out before you decide. So we had it all measured out. Oh, yeah, yeah. Everything uh, was figured out. We did a pre-installed plan. Uh, a couple of gentlemen from DSC came in. Tom worked with them. Facilities here worked with them. Roger Elliott. Um, there was a few other of the crew that worked, and everything was measured out.